And that, alas, went horribly wrong. And it wasn't the greatest penalty. And it's been saved by the keeper. And he's beaten the keeper. Can he get the better of the keeper? In it goes. Can he remain calm? And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. Clinical as always in front of goal and he steps up to take his penalty So lethal in front of goal Goalkeeper beaten from the spot Composure is so important under these trying circumstances and the penalty converts it here. It won't be lost on him. What's at stake here? He knows he's got to score. He had to score, and he does. Mental preparation is such a big part of this. Job done from the spot. And it's gone in. And up he comes, doing his best to remain focused. And confidently converted. Can he keep us cool? And there it is. Perfectly executed. And the keeper denies them from the spot. It comes down to this. A goal, and they win the game. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. And he scores. Well, dead center with that penalty. And he steps up to take the shot. He's gambled on direction and won. Well, it comes down to this. In and they win. Well, what an end into a very good tournament, and I think they fully deserve to win it. Maybe not in this manner, though, but it was great entertainment. It certainly was, and they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment for everyone involved with the club, but for their opponents, it's a case of trying to forget and move on as quickly as possible. Well, I think we should give them some credit, too. They played their part in what was an excellent contest. Some of their football was brilliant. Yes, fair play, Stuart. The party in full swing now. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here.
Argentina, world champions. They did it in 1978 and 1986. They've done it again in 2022, Stuart. Well, this is the pinnacle of any footballer's career and what a night it's been for these players and the coaching staff and, of course, the fans. And the